Okay. Remember what we're doing now. Um, I'm Gideon, and you're the angel, right? I'm the angel? Yes, you're the angel for once in your life. Aww. <laughs> do I get to wear wings? Uh, sure. You, you can do anything you want because you're not on camera. <laughs> okay, so I'm Gideon, and this right here is uh, going to stand for the wine press where I am hiding right now. And the reason I'm hiding is that there are 120,000 Midianites down there in the valley, and they are terrorizing the Israelites. They're, they are coming up and burning our homes, burning our crops, uh, taking our wives. They're, they're, they're terrorizing us. And so we are all hiding. Everyone's hiding. And I'm hiding in the wine press because I'm, I'm beating out wheat. Would, would, would be great if it could be wine, but no, it's wheat because we got to get some nourishment. So that's what I'm doing and when the angel shows up. Okay, ready? Ready. All right. Get in. Yoo-hoo. Get in. Who, me? Mighty hero. The, what? Lo the Lord is with you. Me? No, no, that's no. I'm not. I, I'm. I think you got the wrong wine press. Try, try the one down on the corner. That's that's it. Gideon. Your yes. name. Your name yes. is Gideon. Yes. Go with strength, and rescue Israel from the Midianites. I have sent you. Me. You. You're sending me. You. And God sent Gideon. He was the smallest clan in the least of the tribes of Israel, and God chose him to free the people. Well, I don't know about you, but that's me. I feel like that all the time. I feel like I'm hiding all the time. I feel like uh, there's way too much out, too many enemies, too much to try and do out there that I can't manage it. And, uh, you know, I, I, I understand this, and I, and I bet you too, too, because I think we're all basically insecure inside, and we're not sure we have what it takes. And so this is going to be showing us how we all have power, and the Lord has given us power to go forth and do what we have to do, what he's called us to do in the world. And this is, we're all going to be just like Gideon. We're going to have victory.